Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? Nice. Good. Were you on vacation, Ricardo? Yes, I finished because uh, today I be, I reopened the 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 the, the, the meals. <laughs> Okay, so today was your first day. Yes, yes, but but yesterday is uh, what's a very hard because uh, we have to install the the I don't know the protocol. Uh, yeah, protocol. Protocol. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. All right. Welcome back. Thank you, teacher. Yeah. All right. So welcome back, everybody. Today is June the sixteenth, two thousand twenty. It's time for another English session. Briefly, let's talk about um, what we did yesterday. Do you remember the topics we discussed yesterday? Anybody? Only one, only one. The adjectives. The adverbs or? Adjectives. Adjectives, yes. Yes, we were talking about adjectives. Adjectives, as you guys said yesterday, the function is to describe a noun, a place, animal, people. They describe everything. And adjectives, they finish with different termination. They have different endings. Yesterday's class, was to see the difference between ed and ing with adjectives tired tiring excited excited um fascinating fascinated so um which provokes the other one which one is responsible for the other one The ING is responsible to the result with the ED. Because exactly. It's like a, a feeling. Exactly. It's a consequence. Yes. So you say, look, the new cell phone that I have is very interesting. Interesting. ING. I'm describing a cell phone. So I say, this cell phone is very interesting. So what is the result? I am interested. How do you say interesting in Spanish? This cell phone is interesting. Uh huh. And if I said, so the result is that I'm interested. How do you say that word in Spanish? Interesado. Right. So um, the same way in Spanish, interesado is very different than interesante. English is exactly the same. You say interesting to describe something or to describe how someone is. You say interested to express feelings. Let me, um, I don't know if I, um, if I got rid of the, let's see, I think I have it here. Okay, do you see the image? Yes. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. so yesterday we were discussing how ING is responsible for ED. The books are boring. They're really boring. So when you read them or they ask you to do whatever exercise, the person using these boring books will be bored. So once again, ING is responsible to provoke ED. So we were talking about this. Um, if, the, if the adjective finishes in ING, that indicates that it will provoke something. And that result is going to come with the ED. Are there any questions? Our first exercise today is related with this. Um, any questions about 
the difference between the ing and the ed in adjectives do you guys remember the rules for pronunciation of regular verbs in in, in the simple past form do you remember the rules like sometimes ed sounds like t sometimes it sounds like d and sometimes it sounds like l do you remember that class yeah. yes okay so the same rule the same rule that we discussed that day for that particular topic we use the same rule for pronunciation with adjectives that finish in the ed form so uh you say bored excited uh, according to the termination of the of the adjectives um, any questions or comments about this no question okay um, any comments about the other topics that we discussed yesterday no 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 okay so let's begin with uh, first exercise, which is related to what we're speaking about right now. Did I send you this? Uh, I sent you this image yesterday, didn't I? Yes. Okay, and did you finish doing the first part? No. No. Okay. Only first four questions. Okay, only the first, okay, so let me, um, okay, 9 to 10 p.m., 9 to 10 p.m., it's right here. Okay, let's see if I can, take a picture. Okay, so I will assign you to work in pairs. Um, there's a possibility that you will work with someone different uh, today. So if that's the case, uh, you start with the first question of the first part, and then I just send you to the WhatsApp chat the second part. Um, any questions about uh, what you need to do? Oh. Okay, so let's do this. And here we go.
to travel around of the world and to know different countries, different customs about the people. The problem is that microphone is was open. Oh yeah. my god. And all the classmates heard the 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 word. Yeah. <laughs> Clear and loud. Yeah, this is was embarrassing. Yes, it's true. <laughs> What's about you? Now I that was mm, ah, okay, I, I remember something. Uh, one day, uh, when I was walking in the airport, I yeah. I uh, fall it all on my my coins on mm -hmm. the floor, <laughs> and I can't pick up because of my nails. This oh. is <laughs> for me. You have long nails. Yeah. Now, now don't. But in that way. In that uh, time, that, yes, okay. long nails and acrylic is difficult to pick up something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Two. Okay. Number two is when was the last time you were embarrassed? Embarrassed. 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 Yes. In... I'm not sure. I don't remember. <laughs> Mm. Yes. I don't know. It's a very difficult situation for them. <laughs> yes, because I don't remember. <laughs> mm. But the speech is, I don't know. How it's weird. Provi no. Proveniente? 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 Coming from. Comes from. Yeah. from. Comes from, okay. Um, the from Japan. What is Japan? Oh no 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 no. Um, is is Tokyo. Um, ah, Tokyo. A fish. Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, it's, um, it's weird. A fish is from, yes, it's weird. And I found. And I found here in El Salvador. Really? Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. But what do you think? Is there maybe something happened, some change in the in the ocean? Time. Uh, you hear the some virus, some virus, sorry, some virus appear, but in this country it never comes. Mm, I think that maybe here in El Salvador, this uh, pandemic was caused by uh, other people that travel to the other countries. And here in, in our country, uh, they they cause the, the problem, I think. Yeah. Uh, in some case, uh, it's the idea that uh, for the wind, maybe the 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 virus travel, but that is a a, a little idea. But mm, I'm not sure about this idea. I only l listen this idea for other people's. Yeah, yeah, I agree with you. Um, number six. No, number, number five. five. Yeah, what, I'm going to read. Kind? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to read the five. Okay. Uh, what kind of activity do you think are exciting? Um, it depends. Uh, some sports are exciting in some cases. Uh, um, can you uh, repeat? Some, some sports are exciting in some cases. Uh, it depends on the sport. Uh, yeah. uh, that is my idea. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Are exciting activities exciting? Mm. Um, exciting activities. Okay. 
No, I, I never watch only the broadcasting or maybe reading, but not see, no, not watch news. No, I don't like it. Guy, what does it's nowadays important mean? to be updated. Excuse me? What? What does nowadays mean? Nowadays? Yeah. In these days? In these days, oh, oh yes. In these days? The current. Yeah. Like, like, like Chileans say. Or currently. Yeah, it's a, it's a synonym of currently. Oh. Yeah, thank you. Yes. And I don't watch TV only. It's very interesting, your, your hobby. Yes, yes, because it's, uh, when we get a relax, we have to, to read a lot on the practice and the is uh, living in the, in the present, not in the future, not in the past. It's only in the present. It's a healthy practice. Yes, it's yeah. to get a relax yeah. in, the, in the, my mind. <laughs> okay, and Kim Kimberly Nolasco is a is a new partner. No, I I start in the first day. <laughs> yes. yes. Ah, but, okay. Uh, we we was speaking about. My fullness, it is focused in the present, not in the future and not in the past, only in the present when you do activities and can, can spare your time in a good way. In that when you practice and you feel the all things you do in, in the day, and some things like that. <laughs> Yes, I think Carlos. I think that Kimberly is a a shade about the what is the think about the 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 practice of the of the of the of the of the, of the, of the uh, living the, in the present. <laughs> yes, okay. I consider that is important. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. For okay, okay. The next one, okay. the number number four. Do you oh, feel that? Yes. Why or why not? Well, sometimes I feel tired because it is 10 p.m. and have you ever lived something? I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> that is a lie. I don't believe you <laughs> because I think everybody has something embarrassing in their, in their life. Yeah. But okay. <laughs> Number seven. Okay. Do you ever do physical activities that are very tiring? Very. Before this, I made crossfit. What's very tiring? Tiring. What? Excuse me. What is tiring? Que lo cansa. Ah. Ah. Okay. I, I. I was right. So I. I used to be. I used to. Um. Do. Crossfit. That was um, very tiring. How much time do you practice? Two hours. And I practice like eight months or 10, almost one year, I think. Okay, so do you have a, a specific place where you practice? Like if we're not in the emergency, well, we're not in the emergency anymore, but you go to a gym or something? No, no, I, I dedicate my life to rest. Really? <laughs> now, nowadays, yes. Okay. But maybe when the, the gym open again, I will go. And incorporate again. 
Yes. All right. For your hair, for the reason I think that uh, nowadays is too depressing to see the news. Yeah, I think that from my point of view is is not held uh, for our mind because, okay. uh, for example, in this country that we live, the violence is is a lot of depressing. If you if you see every day the same the same news is depressing yeah okay the last one the last one what kind of activity do you do you do that are relaxing um that is a, a I found another, another word that is belfi do you know what a belfi is no what is a belfie is belfie. A, a selfie but taken from behind when you shows up your butts front a mirror oh. that's a uh, belfie <laughs> ah okay <laughs> a new word for me because i, I, didn't, I didn't even yeah, know it too <laughs> yeah, it's the first time i hear that word too <laughs> okay repeat the word I try to write that. <laughs> Belfi. How do you spell that? Belfi. B E L F I E. Belfi. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting word. <laughs> Different. Um, there are many languages uh, uh, too, and the the most common is talking English in Malaysia. It was a good benefit with you to you. What? It yeah. was a good benefit to, to you. Ah yes, they yes. Speak in English. Speaking mm -hmm. English, yes, yes. But it's whatever you whatever I produce in Malaysia, whatever I understand you. Because <laughs> it's a it's a bad English, whatever. There is a, 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 it's a other person is a Chinese, other person is a, um, is a, uh, a very language of Mal Malaysia, is very, um, is not so, is a, 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 a many languages. So mm -hmm. the, the, the English is, is the only for coming for to express in the, in the streets. Ah, okay. Okay. Is, uh, it was very, very easy. It's very easy to you and, and, and your trip or uh, was a, a difficult for communicating with the, the people. It's uh, because uh, we, we went to other, the other person that is a Japanese. We have to, <laughs> to mix this, uh, a Japanese and English. Uh, or, or it's a, uh, it's a, we we uh, we say uh, a mix is uh, Japanese uh, Spanish is Japonol. <laughs> and can you understand <laughs> Japanese? Japonol. <laughs> <laughs> so Ricardo, you you were in Malaysia. Yes, I went to Malaysia four years ago. Okay. In, I went to Japanese uh, 25 years ago. Oh, was it for pleasure or work related? No, it's a for work because I I, I worked in the in a Japanese company for uh, almost uh, 30 years. Okay, which 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 company, uh, Ricardo? It USA USA. Oh. USA is a, a Japanese company belong to uh, Toyobo Toyobo company. Okay. Oh. So you have been in Asia before? Yes, it's uh, Asia for uh, yes. I, I went to Japanese a uh, uh, Japan. I went to Malaysia. Um, uh, this is uh, there are many many uh, meals uh, around the world. Good. How long time are you in the USA? Uh, Ricardo? Repeat it, I, I couldn't understand you. 
How long time are you working in USA? Ah, it's uh, about 30, almost 30 years. It's a lifetime. You understand. Every, it's, a, it's, a long year. Time. it's a lot of time. <laughs> yeah. When you, when you, when you was uh, a treat a uh, Japan, is, is you, you was very young. Yes, yes. It's uh, almost a, uh, uh, yes, it's a uh, 20, 20, go, 20 go years ago. It's a very young, today is. <laughs> You're different now. Yes, I'm different now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's very interesting the cultures uh, to know the other cultures. It's, uh, right. Uh, yes, I, I am interested uh, in return. Is uh, for uh, uh, a a pleasure to to visit uh, uh, again in the future. I think. <laughs> yeah, I imagine that those two countries are really nice. You know, Malaysia and, and Japan. Yes, yes. In Malaysia, in Malaysia is is uh, interesting because there are three cultures, there are three religions different, there are many languages different. Is uh, the compound the the, the, tre, the the three the three uh, is uh, in in Hindu, in Chinese, in in Malaysian. Okay. Is a is 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 the the person is about uh, forty Malaysian and the thirty thirty Chinese and thirty uh, Hindu. Okay, oh, yes. that's, that's interesting. That's good to know. Yeah. Yes, uh, and there are many many uh, many uh, kind of food, a different kind of food. <laughs> yeah, I imagine. I imagine. Yes. And did right. you like it? What? Did you like it, the food? Yeah, yes, because the Malaysian now, because it's very spicy. It's, uh, mm. it's uh, the, the most common okay. for us is a uh, Chinese food. It's uh, good. But uh, the, the Hindu and the Malaysian is very spicy, very spicy, the, the food. Okay. What kind of animals uh, do you try in, in this, uh, in Malaysia? Uh, it's a, it, Malaysia is a, it's a big, it, when I stay in a city, I don't have the many animals. <laughs> it's a, it's a, um, it, because it's a, it's a mother's, city which I stay in Kuala Lumpur, Kuala Kansara. I stay in Kuala Kansara. Okay. And visit Kuala, Kuala Kansara, yes. In Kuala Lumpur is uh, the right the, the, the towers, the tower the is Petrona. The Petrona, yes. The, the Petrona, Petrona Towers. The Petrona Tower Twins, yes. Good, good. I, I visit I, I visit the Petrona tower tower. Good, good. Good for you, Rick. Yes, it was an excellent experience. Yeah. <laughs> Next time you go take one of us. <laughs> All right, let's go back. When when you go back, you have to take one of us. You ah, have yes. to invite one of us. Yes. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go back. That will be interesting. <laughs> All right, good. <laughs> All right. Um, any questions about the exercise uh, you guys just finished? Is, is everything clear, the differences between ED and ING in adjectives? Yes. Yes. All right. So um, if, if there is one topic uh, that you might feel that is a little bit more, different, more difficult than others, you need to practice it more. Practice makes perfect. Practice makes perfect. Yeah. Okay, so let's... Uh, Let's do one exercise here. I got here. 
All right. Have you guys been uh, using the platform? Yep. Yeah, you have to. Remember that the platform, that's, that is the part where Insafor checks your, um, your performance. So it is necessary that you guys check the platform. Okay, so let's do number one. Johnny Depp is a very what? Can you see the image? See the picture. No, oh, yes. sorry. Um, sorry. No. My bad. My bad. Sorry, Papa. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, can you see it now? Yes. Yes. Okay, good. So we have Johnny Depp is a very what actor? Amazing. 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 Okay, what about number two? I find animated films. Amusing. 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 You're describing a movie, you're describing programs, so you need to use ING. Remember that ED expresses feelings, so they're, they're different. Uh, number three, I'm not blank in science fiction movies. Interesting. 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 Neither am I. I don't like science fiction movies. I'm not interested. Number four. Volunteer for number four. I am bored. I am bored. By watching bored. television. And, you know, now that we just finished the emergency that we had in the country, that's what a lot of people were doing watching TV, watching TV. Okay, number five, another volunteer. Mm -hmm. I thought Jurassic Park was an interesting book. Uh, interesting. Exciting. Exciting book. Exciting. Uh -huh. Exciting. Exciting book. I was reading yes. another one. Yes. <laughs> so I thought Jurassic Park was an exciting book okay what about number six um fascinated by drr talking novels yes fascinated fascinated number seven someone else is it surprising or surprised it's surprising. Yes. You're describing a situation. So you're, you're supposed to use ING. What about number eight? I was really, there is a mistake there. Yes, yes. Yeah, there is a mistake. It's, it's the same so, <laughs> okay, so what should be the right form? Shocked. 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 So remember, um, the platform has some uh, some mistakes that could be fixed for the next module. What about number nine? The mess was disgusting. Disgusting. And number ten. Uh, I always find trailers, I always too, find confusing. trailers too confusing. 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 All right, good, good. Any questions about the 10 exercises we just did now? No. Oh. No? Okay, good. Now we go with the uh, vocabulary section. We're going to be talking about, um, let's see. Carolina, do you have a question? No. Okay. Let's see this here. I have a question, but it's not of this topic. Yeah, right. ask me. Sure. It's just about our 
WhatsApp account it's gonna end? No, it's not going to end. Uh, a good thing that you mentioned it. Um, David, he was just announcing that the number he had in charge was going to disappear. Um, so his number is not included in the chat anymore. The chat continues um, to function the same way it has been uh, it has been used. So the the the, the, the WhatsApp chat it's it's it stays normal. Okay. Yes. Good yeah, question. We need it. Yeah. Yeah. Good question. Okay. So let me share. This one. Hold on. Share. Share. I don't understand why I get this. Hold on, give me a second. D I N G. Right, but that's not the one that I want to show you. It was about the vocabulary. That's not it. No, that's not it either. How many people there are in this room? Uh, like 15. Let's see, my goodness. All right, anyways, so I'm gonna have to skip that uh, uh, activity. All right, so what's the celebration tomorrow in El Salvador? Father's Day. Father's Day. Okay, Father's Day. How how do Salvadorians celebrate Father's Day? With vacation. With vacation. Okay. <laughs> with a, with a gathering, a family gathering. Okay, with a family and gathering. Dinner with the older of the house. <laughs> Good, yeah. You know, like we celebrate to the to the oldest of the house, um, sometimes it's not only one. It can be your father and your grandfather and yourself, maybe. Or it can be yeah. one of your sons, you know, like if he's, uh, if he's got children already, he's included too. So, so what are the traditional presents that we give to fathers in El Salvador? <laughs> A ties. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Socks. Hey, hey. Okay, ties, socks. Uh, what else? T-shirts. <laughs> T-shirts. Uh huh. Bottle of wine. Bottle of wine. Yeah. Alcohol. Okay. Alcohol. <laughs> Any type of alcohol is good. Yeah. In some cases, sure. Shoes, yes. We will eat cake. Yeah, yeah. And, and sometimes, you know, like, okay, so, like, maybe you don't cook what he really likes, but you have a, a, a cake to celebrate Father's Day. Yes. All right? Now, now that... But, but a cake sounds like a birthday. Yeah, so you, you yeah. may have, like, if he likes pizza, okay, let's call pizza and cake. If he likes chicken, let's call chicken plus cake. So some people have the tendency to uh, include cake as well, right? Yes. Okay. Now, now with this situation that we just finished in El Salvador, how do you think many Salvadorian families will celebrate Father's Day? 
Is it going to be the same as years before, a little bit different? What do you think? It's going to be a little bit different. Uh-huh. For the quarantine time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah so in, our, in our case, uh, we have a, a neighbor and he, he he's going to share a, his, tur his turkey. Oh, okay. Yes. And the Father's Day is tomorrow, but in our case, we are going to celebrate after after three days until Saturday. Oh, okay. Uh, that's a good idea, you know. Yeah, we are going to do uh, Turkish bread. Okay. Yes. Good. That's good. Remember that sadly, the most of fathers of Salvadorians are in the U.S. because yeah. a lot of things that had happened in our country, but God bless the fathers that decided to stay with their family. Right. Yeah. Okay, anybody else wants to share something? Not now. Not now. Okay, let me see if I can find uh, this conversation. Where's this conversation? I don't know why this... Uh, It's a beautiful basketball. Yeah, it is. No, that's not the one. Okay, give me a second. Give me just one second. Tomorrow, a lot of family can call deliveries. Right. Or food of different kind so yeah oh, yeah very. they will be they will be busy the delivery people they will be busy tomorrow is, is not going to be possible to call the delivery <laughs> yeah it, it might happen we tried on on mother's day i think that we were trying to call because we were in the middle of the quarantine the phone was always busy and we try like every hour busy busy and i say look there is no answer so we um so we left it we left the celebrations for 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 like two days later i think Let's see this year and we will be have classes tomorrow yes we have classes it's it's normal we don't have free day <laughs> no there's no vacation here okay give me a second